Thank you so very, very much. Uh, I'm sorry I have to talk over the music. I couldn't quite figure out how to get rid of this. Uh, I am trying to do... Wait, hang on. Already we're going swimmingly, so... Um, I'm, I was a little bit delayed. I, of course, it needed some time to update and everything like that, so... Uh, we're going to take a look at NHL 17. Thank you for every very, everyone so very, very much for coming out to uh, check out and be the uh, see it firsthand along with me. So, uh, of course, I've maybe you're watching this upload onto uh, YouTube at the moment, but uh, no, this this is live after midnight here. Uh, well, it's probably going on closer to one o'clock. Uh, uh, but uh, I had uh, all this time to uh, download it, uh, take a look at it, play it around with the uh, settings like that. But uh, as far as looking at everything else is, it looks fantastic. Uh, they changed it up. It's more brighter. You know, like It used to be a, a, a black menu screen, but now they've gone with a, a really bright white and everything like that. So um, I still, I, this annoys me the heck. I'm trying to broadcast. I don't want this uh, background music at all. Why can I not change it? Alrighty. Um, so uh, we are going to uh, uh, check this out. And we're going to, uh, of course, uh, see what the penguins look like here. And let's see if uh, they got, um, of course, you know, their default with the uh, home and away uh, is... Uh, Fantastic! Thank you very much uh, for. I guess uh, they are going to go with uh, those jerseys next season, but but if you're still uh, desiring, like me, I do enjoy the uh, metallic gold uh, look uh, like this. Or you want to go really old school? You want to go out to uh, see? They still have the classic jerseys in here, and. Um, yeah, these jerseys here, uh, the other jersey, uh, Penguins jersey that I own, looks like that one. And uh, I certainly prefer those jerseys to the ones that they're, I guess, going old, you know, retro with the, uh, that logo. And hopefully when I do uh, end up uh, uploading this to uh, YouTube, uh, it won't give me a uh, DNC or, you know, or whatever uh, uh, thingamajiggy, so... I uh, hopefully it'll be okay uh, to upload. So there is the uh, alternates for them and their classic jerseys. So we're gonna play around with it. Yeah. Okay, fantastic. So we're gonna go with uh, uh, this one here. Go with that one there. Alrighty. Uh, game settings. Make sure that uh, we go over to uh, quick settings. See, and then uh, this is what they showed me right as you uh, start playing the game. Uh, that is uh, uh, what you have to go into, exp uh, like your NHL experience and this column here, like that. And so it helps you through. Uh, you get the most out of uh, the game as possible. You, if you're not very good at the game, like that, then uh, uh, on ice trainer, I want to go to uh, that there, and yeah, that there as well. So we'll uh, go on to the game. So yeah, and game settings, like that. I I not there. I did that, but uh, on. Yeah, volume settings. Why did they change? Okay, arena announcer volume, commentary volume. I'll turn that down. Okay. Uh, FX volume, music. Okay. All right, go on. Crowd volume, commentary volume, soundtrack. All right. There we go. Now we got rid of the... Uh... Now, can I make that permanent? Because I tried fixing it before. So, already we're off to a semi-bad start. I don't I don't really like talking over the music. And uh, uh, hopefully we can uh, get things uh, going uh, now on here. So, uh, this is, of course, Hockey Night. Uh, this is Confessions of a Hockey Fanatic. 
release party and I want to take a good look at all the teams here and the new settings and the new graphics and the wonderful, wonderful game that they've somehow goofed up already. Oh, well. Maybe I can go back and edit all that out. <laughs> but I guess uh, that's what it is when you show, try to... Yeah, you want my instant reaction here. Like, at, I'm exploring this new game with you, and I want to know uh, what it's going to look like from here on out, how I'm going to come up with the uh, game of the week. Here's uh, Edzo and Doc. Uh, congratulations for making it yet again into the game, and uh, we have no idea what they're saying because I turned down their volume. I don't want to over... Uh, talk to them. I don't want to talk over them. I don't want to like it. Uh, I'll turn it back on when I'm playing privately offline. But uh, as far as broadcasting is concerned, uh, get my head cut off like it. I want to sit back a little bit further like that and maybe get back into frame here. So uh, either way, I want to uh, check things out. And Ed says going on way too long. I don't care what you're saying. There's. Um, Sid the kid looking like it's pretty sharp look at it. it's almost look at that it's it's like he's really there look at that that's phenomenal and a new new mask there for Murray wow look at that look at that I mean that that's just it's like they're really there And hold me! <laughs> yeah, I'm going through his warm ups there. Fantastic. All right, let's see. I, I imagine the NHL 17 to be a lot like NHL 16. And of course, I lose my first face off. No surprise there. Get into the passing lane. Good. Good job. Uh, who's that uh, shooting target? All right. So they brought back all the uh, extra help that uh, you need to get better uh, if you're need to uh, uh, shoot a little bit better, more on target. They help you out with that uh, uh, targeting system like that. If you want to stay off sides and everything like that, else, uh, they'll, I'm sure that they'll uh, have the offsides uh, meter uh, come on there. Whoa, hey, 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 hey. Oop, glitch. How about that? Quick little... There we go. Passing. Hard. Whoa, hey. Okay, come on. And this can in. Oh. So that's pretty interesting. They they've already set up Murray as the uh, opening goaltender ahead of Marc Andre Fleury. I'm sure they'll probably fix that. Well, it, uh, it, I don't know who's going to be uh, scored as the uh, opening night uh, goaltender, but. Uh, as you can see from NHL 17, they've, uh, there we go. Look at that. Beautiful, beautiful shot. Good job. Good job. One nothing, Penguins. One nothing. Now, if you're watching a Capitals fan, don't worry. We're not going to play it out. Uh, uh, we're not going to uh, complete this whole game. We're just going to give the uh, viewers here uh, on Twitch.tv, uh, Hockey Nights, uh, and on uh, uh, NHL Confessions of a Hockey Fanatic uh, block, hockey, hockey Fan at Blogspot.com for those of you uh, who want to uh, watch it on the blog. It's much appreciated. Oh, got my, what is that? Offsides? Wow, is that crowd... <laughs> It's quite loud here in my headphones, but um, all right. Hopefully, it's not too bad for you guys at home. But uh, yeah, look, the uh, camera angles are uh, pretty much standard as far as uh, whoop, uh, eh, oh, too many stick handling there. So you got to check off her stick handling, but got it taken away from me. That's that's not good. All right. 
Oh, whoa, was that dangerous. Oh my goodness, was that dangerous. All right, let's get back out. Oh, oh, somebody was on the doorstep. Almost, almost made it. All right, back us around. Nope, and no good there either. Okay, nope, couldn't get it out. And... No. Weak little shot. Try to dump it in. Cole back there. Trying to skate with him. Just don't let it get past you. Don't let him get past you. Oh. Magalin up to Benino. No. Yeah, <laughs> they have the Hagelin Benino Kessel line already pre uh, defaulted on this game. That's awesome. So that's a, uh, something things we have already uh, learned about this game is that uh, Matt Murray is in goal for the default. The uh, HBK line is already on there as the default. I haven't messed up with I haven't messed with the lines at all. I haven't uh, done anything. You saw me uh, play the game here. Nope, up a little high. Try and get that out there. Nope. Nope. There we go. Come on, Crosby. Didn't quite make it. Alrighty. There we go. But four or five left to this. I think we're going to uh, shorten this up. I think, may yeah, maybe let's play out this period here and move on to showing you some of the other uh, things in NHL 17. Uh, I'm glad that you've joined me here at uh, Confession of the Hockey Fanatic. Uh, uh, please uh, continue to do so as we explore the game and uh, explore uh, just how much uh, this game has to offer. I'm sure that there are a lot more uh, teams and players. I've uh, seen uh, that the EHL uh, uh, e ECHL teams are in here. Um, I don't know who else is going to be in here, but uh, uh, the, uh, the uh, World uh, uh, World Cup team, not uh, yeah, World Cup teams are in here. Uh, so yeah, it's it's going to be phenomenal. All right, and if you have any questions, just uh, post them in chat. I got the uh, lappy open or on my laptop uh, computer. I'm looking at the things going on here. Um, oh, wow. Look at that. The, you can have more control over the goaltender and how he passes it better than last year's like that. That was a lot more animation, a lot more just... I, I think they spent a lot of uh, time, like, just... I'm speechless, really. This is... The guys truly look like the guys. They, they are really, really doing uh, their best to bring this uh, into almost looking re uh, real. About as real as a simulation can. It's phenomenal. Like it, uh, Alrighty, so the Washington Capitals lose one nothing to Pittsburgh Penguins, and we'll just call that a loss because hey, uh, let's see, yeah, uh, only had one face-off win, sixty-eight point four. Oh, they're gonna <laughs> they're gonna go uh, decimal points now, huh? Alrighty, I don't know how they figure that out, but all right, uh, sixty-eight point four is just about the. Uh, uh, Total of nine sh uh, shots for them, eight shots for that, but alrighty, we're gonna get out of here. Quick game. Alrighty, so we're gonna have to find out to uh, uh, get rid of all that uh, music as well. Uh, so next time we uh, meet here at uh, next Tuesday for the uh, Confession of the Hockey Fanatic Game of the Week, uh, we will have to do the uh, uh, uploads. 
Okay. Uh, use newest updates. Okay. Yes, uh, yes, I would like to proceed. Interesting. Okay. All right. So how do we get rid of this music again? I really, really don't want this music. My goodness, people. It's good. It's, it's good music, but when I'm broadcasting, I don't want this music. How can I turn it off? Do I have to go in through the settings? Did it did it not save in the settings? All right. So. All right. How do I? change the now it was the left and right bumpers to all right let's see all right customize all right let's go over to customize let's explore that for a little bit all right uh settings modify global preferences okay go to quick settings now watch, they'll probably all be uh, uh, back where you know, they were defaulted at. Game settings. Okay. Don't want that. All right. Audio and visual settings. Okay. Volume settings. See, now look, you saw me change them. Okay. Commentary volume. We're in a music volume. I want to turn that off. Control thing. I saw track control. Alrighty. Alright. Now. That should do it. Alright. If you want to hear the rest of the music and the rest of the uh, soundtrack, I uh, I recommend you check with someone else that has NHL 17 and uh, ask them to uh, play it for you. But uh, as for me and trying to broadcast, that's annoying. And I, I'm sorry, I just had to shut it off. Okay, so now that that's all gone. All right. Manage the wrong right, creation zone. Create your own custom teams and players. Fantastic. They brought the uh, create uh, create a team uh, back. That's wonderful. Create a player. Let's go with skater because uh, that this is certainly all right. Nothing new has changed here uh, as far as that is concerned. Is uh, certainly uh, maybe an updated face or something like that. Uh, I, okay. Oh, there we go. Female. Wow, look at that. They got... Uh, why are they all bald? <laughs> all right. They, yeah, you can change uh, faces. Fantastic. And, uh, yeah. And then... You can uh, change the hair. Uh, that's. You can change the hairstyle to uh, hair color as well, like that. If you want to make her blonde or make her a uh, orange, that's not too bad. Faded blonde, red. Wonderful, wonderful. Look at that. Look at that. That's how you do it, ladies and gentlemen. I am so incredibly impressed. They finally heard me. Look, here's a... Give her some white hair, or maybe make her a strawberry blonde. Or make her silver-haired. Make her a little bit older. Or maybe she just dyed it that way. I don't know. Girls are into that sort of thing now. When they, they uh, dye their hair different colors that are like either blue or silver or anything like that. Or make it light brown or black. Like that. Look at that. That's... Absolutely fantastic hairstyle. Let's see what kind of hairstyle that uh, the. So I'm certainly glad that uh, the uh, girls are allowed to make their own uh, uh, character in it. Like you, I, if they well, they don't have to, but I mean, if you're 
uh, you want to have yourself represented in the game, then it's a great way to get uh, keep more fans into the game and keep them interested and uh, keep them you know interested in playing this game. You know, it, it's it's a really really fantastic time that uh, with this you know whole. Uh, ordeal. So let's go back to. Let's get out of here and see what we can do with the. Oh yeah, we can even change the eye color too. How about that? Make it light, make it light blue, or maybe a yellowish. Wow, look at that! It really shows up in our uh, green. Maybe? Okay. Okay. Well, we're not going to, I'm going to, uh, when uh, on my own time, I am going to uh, play around with the uh, uh, creative characters and uh, such. So, oh, uh, you can even have your own uh, edited uh, default uh, goal celebrations. Kind of yeah, playing guitar. Look at that. Yeah, you can look at that. Doing push-ups, saluting, baton twirling. That's nice. Of course, uh, don't be around. Uh, don't stand around her when she's doing that. <laughs> Get whacked in the head with the baton twirling. Dancing around there, laying down, doing snow angels. Let's see. Uh, Walking backwards. I, oh, I, I don't know what that was, but okay. Throwing your stick around. That's another <laughs> another dangerous move. Kids, don't try that at home. <laughs> don't imitate everything you see on the uh, uh, video games. Swim technique. I don't know what that was. Here we go. This is an oldie but goodie. Here is a sniper. Sniped it. <laughs> Alrighty. Jump up and down. Do a awesome little headstand. And shoot it down. Yeah. Alrighty. I'm at, of course, I, I imagine the equipment and attributes are uh, att <laughs> attributes. Look at that. I'm becoming Canadian. It's boot time. <laughs> All right. So on this PCM, Easton, Bar, Easton, Sherwood, Warrior, Titan, Retro Stick, Titan. Wow. Get all these Easton. Okay, go over here to stick blade tape. Of course, I like this style right here. That's all you need. That's all you really need. So you don't really need to cover it all. Uh, okay, but let's uh, get out of here and uh, play around with the. Yeah, discard changes. We'll we'll come back and uh, fix her up later. All right, create team. Let's see. Now this is a uh, we've been able to do this uh, a lot in other standard editions and other editions, and when they took it out, everybody threw a fit. Because you you were pretty much stuck you know, when you're making your team online and everything, you were pretty much stuck with, you know, you know whatever NHL team was in your uh, area, or you had to go with NHL uh, jerseys or well, however. But uh, let's see. Oh wow! I guess you can fill up. See, look at all right. So let's look at the uh, leagues that I got here. So they just added the 
NHL, AHL, there's the CHL, the uh, SHL, which I presume is the uh, Swedish ho uh, Hockey League, there's the Finnish Hockey League, the German Hockey League, the Czech Hockey League, the uh, um, Swiss Hockey League, the Nor Norway Hockey League, I don't know. Fantastic, but okay. I don't know, I think it's only like two, not teams in there, but okay. Uh, international teams, the OHL, the Q, the WHL, and of course the uh, CHL prospects. Uh, I don't know why they have to have all these many teams in here. That's like, all you have to do is just do the three teams here. Not like that. That's all, probably only three teams, that, uh, three leagues that I'll be playing with. But no. All right. Uh, Adirondack Thunder, Alaska Aces. There's a Atlanta Gladiators. Fantastic. Brampton Beast. Cincinnati Cyclones. Uh, Colorado Eagles. Colorado Jackals. Florida Everblades. Comets. Uh, Idaho Steelheads. Oh, they went to uh, the fish logo as well. Interesting. They used to be like a steel, like uh, steel heads is in like steel metal. Inter okay, Indy Fuel, Kalamazoo Wings, the Missouri Mavericks. Interesting, the Norfolk Admirals are back. Fantastic. Orlando Solar Bears. So all of these are making their NHL, EA Sports, NHL debut. Quad City Mallards, glad uh, glad they're still around. I know they've been kind of going up and down on the, uh, <laughs> like it used to be AHL team for a while. And uh, so I'm glad that uh, they're still around, still in business like that. It's an uh, awesome team name, the Quad City Mallards. They should be the Ducks minor league team. Uh, it would make sense, you know. So there's Reading Royals, the Carolina Stingrays, Tulsa Oilers are fantastic. You know, if Tulsa has a uh, long tradition like that. Uh, and there's our Wheeling Thunder, or Wheeling Nailers, Wichita Thunder, but uh, Wheeling Nailers for the uh, uh, Pittsburgh, my hometown team, Pittsburgh Penguins affiliate. There's Utah Grizzlies, the uh, one time. Uh, AHL affiliates there. So, all right. So, uh, welcome, uh, ECHL uh, fans. This is fantastic. Uh, thank you uh, so, so much to uh, being able to uh, play in the game there. So, uh, let's look around here at the Marlies. I think they changed their logo to that. And uh, the Tucson Roadrunners are a uh, relocated team. Of course, there's our buddies in Wilkes-Barre. Let's see. Stockton, there's St. John's. I don't know how long they're going to last. I think they're uh, going to move to Laval next year. I don't know why. But, uh, uh, nice of them to stick around for at least one more season. There's the Springfield Thunderbirds. No more... Uh, Springfield uh, Falcons, I, um, they used to be. Uh, San Jose Barracuda, and a lot of these go still are unchanged like that, but a lot of different uh, logos. And yeah, Cleveland, uh, like that, they're no longer Lake Erie Monsters, they're the Cleveland Monsters. I guess they're proud to be uh, from Cleveland now, so they can be inclusive. <laughs> Alrighty, so, all right, let's take a look at the NHL teams here. So, of course, we know all these here. Look at their uh, all the different logos. To point out, there's the uh, new Florida Panthers logo. If you haven't seen that yet, there's uh, they're getting new jerseys uh, this year. Of course, the upgraded Penguins. They you know, got rid of their logo. There's Toronto Maple Leafs logos and the Jets. So, alrighty, let's uh, get out of there and 
look at the details see what we can do here that uh, you know of course we can change the name well what can I just I like that <laughs> setup there that's a beautiful uh, jersey and uh, can we just go with that <laughs> wow you can even name the arena wow all right, let's. All right, let, let's. Hang on here, guys. All right. Wow, and you can even set the uh, market size. All righty, national fan base. Wow, look at this. Oh my, the the different. Wow. All right. Oh my goodness. All right, let's let's go. All right, L2. Ah, okay, good. We don't have to scroll uh, scroll through all those uh, city names. We can just go over here to P and go down here to either you know, Pittsburgh or let's call them the Knights. All right. Team name, Pittsburgh. Okay, team nickname. Let's Hmm. Oh, okay. I see it. Pl uh, played by played team nickname. Okay. So, well, uh, well, we don't wait. Hang on. <laughs> Still trying to learn here, folks. Still trying to learn. Uh, look at that, though. That, that's that's a really. Uh, I I believe it's probably a. Uh, Columbus Blue Jackets without the Columbus Blue Jackets logo. Okay. Wow, look at all these different names you can use for your team. Like the against all, you know, Admiral, Aces, All Stars, Assassins. Okay. All right. Um, go to L L2. Uh, over here. Let's see if they have the. Hopefully, they have Knights in here. There we go. Knights. Fantastic. All right. All right. Change that all up. Abbreviation. Okay. P I. TT. All right. Aces Arena. Let's just change it to. Um, and I. G H T S A R E N A. Okay. All righty. Um, team prestige, bottom, low, average, high, elite. Huh. I guess so. If you uh, you want to. Interesting. Okay. If you want to like set your uh, popularity for the team like that and have how many you know fans in the building and stuff like that and have club seating level. Yeah. Wow. There's so much in depth for this. Okay, to go to the team uniform. All right. Jersey. All right, let's play around with the jersey. I'm sure if we 
change it. It's going to use the same. Yeah, see, it's the same color scheme, just different style. Okay. A little pinstripe in there. I've got that there. It's kind of like Pittsburgh's uh, old jersey with the V type of. Okay. It's like Anaheim Ducks type of. There's um, Buffalo Sabres type of look to it. I think that's more like a Carolina style. That's um, I don't know what that is. That's still nice. Like I, I think I'm I'm when I come back and play around with this a little bit more and, and explore it on my own, I'm probably going to uh, keep this uh, jersey. I uh, think like it, it. It's very 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 nice. Uh, a uh, combo of uh, look at that's Montreal Canadiens type of uh, organization there. It's uh, you know, oh, man, it's that's really nice. There's uh, okay. Let's see how deep we can go into this here. Look at that jersey logos. They have a preset logos. Secondary logo. Oh, wow. Okay. Wow. Yeah, you can even give ourselves uh, shoulder patches. Wow, look at that. All right. Font style. Change the different uh, fonts of the numbers. Wow, look at that. Yeah, to more like that look. And go to that look. Okay. Get out of here. And here's what a goalie would look like. Okay, let's back out of here. All right. Wow, this is really, really nice. You can design your own arena. Look at that. You can put the put your logo on the ice there. Design the line scheme. Get it going right through it, or maybe like that, like that. More St. Louis Blues type of thing. We're gonna go to here with the stars, like that. You wanna do like an All Star game, or just like you know, if you have a there's a American type, you know, three lines there. Probably want to go with that kind of thing or something more solid so the referees know what they're doing. <laughs> you can see the big red line going through in the middle. Oh, it's happened, folks. It's happened. All right. Let's play around for that for a while. So, back out of that there. You can change the colors of the arena and there and their arena presentations. Now, is that gonna? Uh, okay, where's that gonna go? Down there. We can put a goal light down there or up or up here. Or just do the classic uh, lights like that, or we can go vertical like that. Wow. This is amazing. Stanchion effects. Do you want to wait? 
could we color them blue like the Tampa Bay? One solid color, blinking two colors. Carousel, what, is it going to go around and around? Huh. Wow, you can light up the stanchions on this. Wow, this is high. T this is pretty high tech. Wow. Signature. What? What else do you need? All right. Oh, you can do the lightning and the squ. Oh. <laughs> oh, that is so cool. Yeah. Right, here come. Yeah, ride the lightning there. Or you can do the yeah, do the fire there with the you know if you're like a, a Calgary Blaze team or something like that. You know, or you want to go. You know, uh, yeah. Alrighty, alrighty. So back out of that there. Was, uh, Alrighty, so I guess we'll have to uh, play along with this uh, a little bit. Uh, oh, power play presentation? You mean I could select the... Yeah, either hard or... Wait. Yeah, you know. Oh, okay. So, I, uh, all right, that's interesting. You select the song. Select the intro song. Wow. Okay. Uh, affect the seating. And you can change. You can make your own, not only can you make your own team, but you can make your own arena. The netting color. So there you can see it a lot better. Like, wow, you can, I'll have, of course I'll have to come back and uh, change this up to uh, exactly how I, and uh, the way I want it. Uh, like, and I'm not going to bore you with, uh, well, I, hopefully. Hopefully you were interested in seeing all that. Uh, so, alrighty, uh, favorite team. I think we've already chosen our. Yeah, we've already chosen our favorite team there. But uh, all right, I'll enter the uh, product codes there uh, after everything is all done. So, I guess we will go back to uh, doing the. Uh, different franchises and the World Cup of Hockey 2016. I wonder if uh, you, I guess you really can't control, like, all right, you see all the World Cup teams in here. Okay. All right, I'll choose there. I presume then that uh, this is going to yeah you know, take me to a regular tournament style, just like uh, NHL 16 did, like that. But it was already preloaded and preset with the uh, all the different uh, World Cup uh, teams on there so oh, edit a player how about that yeah big buff made a team how about that all right Oh, Palmieri in there. 
Mike Breezy, Applicator, Carlson, Eric Johnson, Les Niskin is in there. Hmm. Okay. Okay, let's back at it. Uh, should, do you want to play this game? Um, all right, let, yeah, let's play this. Uh, uh, what would you like to do? Simulate up to this day? Okay, yeah, we'll see. All right. Play the next game? Yeah, of course we want to play this next game. All righty. Home. Away. Okay. All right. Got their jerseys too. Team Europe. And we'll start the game. Of course, we're not going to play the whole game. This isn't, uh, you know, I, you'll certainly get the field and the idea of. Uh, once I start getting back up with the uh, game of the week feature, uh, all right, World Cup of Hockey 2016, live in Toronto, the ACC. Missed that one up, but all right. Went right through you. What happened? Oh. All right, way to ice the puck here, guys. Well, at least you got it out. Of course, that's uh, Jonathan Quick there. I'm gonna give him uh, a uh, his old uh, thing there. So, oh, I mean his old mask and stuff like that. But anyway, okay. No, oh, Anderson. Okay. Pacioretty takes a shot at it. Oh, wow, this the puck is really, really bouncing quite a bit here. I think the puck control and stick control is highly improved, as in it it's really acts like a, a real puck on stick now where it's uh, uh you know more you know real i guess maybe it depends on the setting like that that um i whoop, i thought there was a uh, breakout pass but oh uh, well Ooh, being tricky there, guys. All right. Nope. Try to get it around there. We're only going to probably play a few more minutes here with uh, this. I just wanted to show off the, I guess, skills and the uh, talent and the rosters of uh, the different teams and stuff like that. And maybe... Uh, Perhaps I will uh, uh, go over, maybe uh, introduce a couple. Whoop. All right. All right. Yep. Marion Gebrick. Way to go. Way to go, buddy. Fellow Slovak. That's okay. I'll let him do that. <laughs> yeah, he's all right. I'll let him do it. 
Thomas Tatar, another slow lock. Offsides, offsides. Reimer, JVR. Reimer's deck. Right, J James Van Reims deck. Alrighty. Um, nope. Try to lost another. Alrighty. Ooh, another one off the posts yet again. Okay. No. Alrighty, so I think we're going to uh, quit this game here. I'm going to, uh, of course, you don't want to see me play the entire game when I've already taken so much time to show you around, show you the new uh, facilities, show you the new, uh, like, uh, like uh, all kinds of different uh, issues with um, the NHL 17. So, uh, all right, let's back out of this. Do I, yes, exit without saving. Don't really need to finish that out. All right. All righty, I'll go over here. All right, now how do I change? There we go, and it... oh, okay, there we go. So we go L2, or there we go, okay, choose league, ECHL. All right, I want Americans, Atlanta Gladiators, formerly the Gwinnett Gladiators. Let's go with them. I like their uh, jerseys, they're nice jerseys, nice colors with the red and black and the gladiator logo okay We're on that thunder faces Meyer Florida Fort Wayne Greenville swamp rabbits ridiculous there's the Idaho Steelheads, Kalamazoo K-Wings. Got a nice jersey there. Look at that. Yeah, it's got a nice little stripe design to it. That's, that's kind of cool. Manchester Monarchs are still in it. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. <laughs> Still the LA Kings uh, affiliate. Hmm. Looks like the Flyers. Or the, maybe the Islanders. May, I don't know what the... I mean, it's the looks like an orange and black. Can't see, and you can't like turn them side to side to do that. So, all right, let's uh, go with that. Missouri Mavericks start the game. See what they look. I uh, see these jerseys in action, and of course, it goes with the whole uh, like interesting, interesting. All righty. Infinite energy. Wow. How about that? Infinite energy. Nope. Still lost another face off. Terrible at that. Nope. Thank you. 
Nope, another shot. Man, I'm shooting wild everywhere. Play the perimeter, keep there. Oh, there we go. See, I knew it in my little, well, they can take a pass. Well, of course, they're in the ECHL. It's, they're probably in the ECHL for a reason. <laughs> well, there we go, hard pass. No, another shot from the distance there. Maybe I have to try and get things on net and then hope for a rebound because none of my uh, long distance shots are working here. So, alrighty, we'll stop it there for uh, the time being. Go back and I'll play this out a little bit more. So is there anything else you guys want to see? Anything that you want to uh, explore? I think uh, we pretty much... Uh, got everything else as far as um, you know what what's new and what's different. What's new uh, is in, of course, you're gonna have to look more at uh, Crosby. Like at since I uh, uh, reset the uh, online team play six leagues, uh -huh. be a career. There's a season mode. Control any team in any league. That's awesome. I can be like AHL, ECHL. So if I, OHL, right? And I go full control, fantasy draft, CPU trades. All right. There we go. That's so cool. So then if I want to change out one of these, like, you know, if I, if I don't want Hamilton in there, if I can swap out. Oh, would that be amazing? Look at, would you look at that? So then if I don't want... Like that, where if I if I decide to, yeah, look at that. If I want to put the, uh, right, well, when, oh, okay, yeah, Tucson over here. All right, so if I wanted to put the other ones in there, oh, I guess I have to back out and go to AHL. Continue. If I want to swap out one of these guys, uh, all right. Who do we like least? <laughs> all right. Who got? Who stays? Who goes? Stockton, maybe. Syracuse, kind of. They're kind of a mainstay. Springfield. Um, okay, let's go Stockton. All right, we'll get rid of them, but we're going to introduce the Hamilton Bulldogs back into the AHL. Yeah, so if I wanted to, uh, well, of course they're at 53, or 63, <laughs> they're going to get their butts kicked in the, uh, they're probably on this, uh, still the same junior team. Start C 
season. Third season. Wow. It's a little bit of a wait. Loads things up, but... Alright, sim to the next game, so I'm up to this day, okay. Let's uh, play a few minutes uh, so we can get introduced to see what uh, uh, the Hamilton Bulldogs jerseys look like. Oh wow, the Hamilton Bulldogs changed their jersey up to black and gold, I guess to uh, match with their... Huh. The uh, Hamilton Tie Cats. I guess they changed up. Uh, pretty smart. Like that, uh, they used to look. Uh, Hamilton used to look like Edmonton Oilers for a while because they were uh, Edmonton's uh, uh, AHL affiliate, and uh, I believe they also uh, were the Montreal Canadiens for a while, and they uh, used the Montreal uh, design. And I guess they, so once they became an uh, uh, OHL team, I guess they uh, you know, took on the uh, black and gold of uh, Hamilton. All right, let's get out of here. We'll play uh, that uh, season some other day. But for now... All right, what else do we want to see here before we uh, get going? We showed you some of the World Cup jerseys. We've seen some of the uh, offline shootout mode, practice mode. I'll play around with the uh, practice mode for a little bit. And then I guess we'll get going here pretty soon. Uh, I don't know how much... Uh, I'll... Uh, free skate we got there. Uh, let's choose Crosby just because. Why did I need a menu for that? Is there like some kind of... Yeah, competition with uh, free skate practice. Rather unusual. Okay. Oh. There we go. There's one for Crosby. Alrighty, so skate coming out, skating around. Nope. A well, lame shot. Nope. Oh. Let's pick around, skate around. So we go down here. Will my uh, goalie be down here? Yeah, there he is. But it's the same <laughs> Murray's uh, in uh, goal down here as it is in. Wait, how can you be in two places at once? Oh my god. Oh my goodness. <laughs> That's a quick goaltender. He's in two places at once. Wait a minute. Maybe Matt Murray has a. Twin. <laughs> Alrighty, so I guess that is it for uh, the uh, NHL 17. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Uh, I had so much fun uh, sharing it with you like that. I guess it had to be tweaked a little bit as far as settings are concerned, so I uh, adjusted it so I can actually talk to you and not over top of uh, loud music or uh, the guys... Uh, uh, announcer uh, Edzo and Doc. Uh, so uh, hopefully uh, you will come back uh, next Tuesday where I have the uh, yet again another. Uh, wait. Well, technically it is Tuesday, but uh, it's not, uh, I guess September 20th. Again, when I guess I have the, my next uh, week of uh, doing uh, the game of the week. 
uh, the new new one with NHL 17. Uh, but until then, uh, uh, thank you everyone for watching. I guess that's all that they have new for the uh, NHL 17. I guess uh, if there's anything other developing, I'll talk about that in the blog itself. Uh, but, uh, you know, I, that's all I, I guess there is to show you. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Thank you very, very much for uh, playing it around uh, with me. Uh, if you want to play me, my... I, you know, Hockey Night screen name uh, is up there. If you want to challenge me to the game, uh, that's great too. But um, I still don't have a sign off. <laughs> but uh, that's uh, the way it goes. I, I'll, you know, I have fun uh, playing this uh, awesome new game. Uh, thank you, and goodbye.